Hey everybody, Brad here. I thought I'd make a real quick video of what the finished product looks like. Of a, just a simple, quick sketch of an aircraft carrier coming, kind of coming at you. And you can kind of see the flight deck and all that, and your, your catapults. There's two of them, three, four. You got four on this one right here. This is the USS Saratoga, the one I've served on in '94. Uh, you can see the island back there. Get on down there and look at the radars and, and the mast back there and the, uh, the bridge where the captain and all them that control the flight deck and the steering of the ship and speed and all that. And you got this mast right here in the very front. It's about halfway down the flight deck. But this right here lets them know uh, wind direction, speed, and all that. So they're uh, better at handling the aircraft when they're taking off and when they're coming down and landing right here. Uh, if you ever wonder what these are, you you got catwalks right here and you got spools of uh, hoses that can go out and refuel the aircraft. They got them on both sides. And uh, also you got these little pods right here. They're life uh boats that would fall in the water when activated and you got antennas all over the place and you can see the anchors you also got sea sparrow anti-ship missiles battery of them right here and you got a phalanx uh system right here with a, uh it might be 20 millimeter i think it's the 20 millimeter gatling gun and some radars and all that and more antennas and your anchors, and you, know, you can see the wave breaking around it. And back here, be part of the superstructure where the uh, aircraft elevator will come down. Be one in the front, and then there'll be two behind the island, which you can't see because it's so far out. And one back here, I do believe. So it had four, but the new Gerald R4. Uh, carriers going to only have three, but anyway, yeah, and right here, I don't know if you see it or not, but right there, that window would have a camera in it, and it filmed all the air operation from launching to actually when they're coming in to recover, and uh, there'd be wires back there to catch them, I didn't draw them, but there's, on this one, they had four going across the area. Anyway, it took like 40 minutes. I started out with a pencil. Then I went to the pens. But, uh, yeah. And, uh, right now, I'm having to flip it. Because I, you know, I film upside down, so I got to flip it. And this software, so that's going to take a while. And, uh, then I'll upload it to YouTube. But, yeah, about 40 minutes. Anyway, thank you for watching. And, uh,